What does the average person really know about Antarctica? That it's a continent way in the south. In fact, it contains the South Pole. And it has too much snow and penguins. But what lies beneath the ice-ravaged exterior? Also, how much of it is dangerous to mankind? Find out in the latest episode of Explained. Insane Facts About Antarctica. Fact number one. Antarctica holds most of the world's fresh water. So, interesting fact within a fact. There are some insane ice sheets in Antarctica. Some are half the length of Mount Everest. This sheet covers the various landscapes of Antarctica. Mountains, plateaus, you name it. In fact, only 1% of Antarctica is truly without ice. And guess what all this ice is made of? Fresh water. Seems kind of unfair when most of the world needs fresh water so bad. On the bright side, it's safe. Humans would have surely polluted it by now. Number two, it's technically a desert. We too thought desert was the standard sand land with enough heat to boil your face off. So how does Antarctica with all of its luxurious ice sheets win the title? Turns out deserts are places where there's less than 150 millimeters of rainfall. Did you know that it took 45 million years for the ice sheet to get this thick? All because it rains so little. London would probably be covered in at least 60 miles thick ice sheet had the temperature been the same as Antarctica. It has rained around one centimeter worth of water in the past 30 years. The fact that it rains so little shouldn't come as a surprise to people who are familiar with the water cycle. The water needs to become gas to go up, then forms clouds and eventually rain. Gets a bit difficult when the water is solid. Number three, it used to warm. Now this sentence looks like betrayal. What do you mean it used to be warm in Antarctica? It goes against the few facts humans actually know. Well, this happened 40 million years ago, so it's a little too late to be offended. You see, the land that is Antarctica used to not be at the South Pole. It moved due to movement of layers of Earth that we call plates. So, when the location wasn't so, well, bad, Antarctica was actually pretty warm and had lush greenery with dinosaurs frolicking about. It either did not age well or aged very well. Number four, it's getting very warm there. Okay, I know we said it was 40 million years ago, but we just have two words, climate change. This area is warming up by three degrees, which means five times as much as any other place on Earth. It may not seem like such a huge difference, but the difference between the Ice Age climate and the world's climate today is just 12 degrees. The entire world stopped being a giant popsicle just by a change of 12 degrees. At this rate, we can kiss the adorable penguin colonies and giant freshwater ice sheets goodbye. Number five, it has active volcanoes. Another claim that seems like a horrible case of juxtaposition, lava? In Antarctica? It's more common than you think. One of the volcanoes is on Deception Mountain. Very fitting, and was discovered by scientists after a horrible five-day climb. The other one is on Ross Island, and is one of the most active volcanoes in the south region of the world. So if you go to enjoy a cool breeze in Antarctica, it might hit you with a hot lava stream from nowhere. Fine, it's unlikely, but it might. Number six. It's not exactly lawless. Antarctica may seem like a dream to an anarchist, no rulers to rule, but there is a treaty through which Antarctica doesn't turn into a weird battlefield as various nations fight for their claim to the land, which is what almost happened when it got discovered. However, 12 nations sat together and agreed on the Antarctica Treaty. It contains all sorts of laws, from the fishing regulation to the opening of the land for scientific discoveries. This had happened in 1952, since then, a lot more lucrative areas of business have been discovered in Antarctica. So, 41 more countries joined in on the treaty and discussed the imposition of new, more strict laws. These include a fishing limitation, mining ban, and sealing. Number seven, it has a blood fall. You know, waterfall, but instead of water, it's blood. We wish we could say it's because of a curse that sacrifices souls to keep the fall flowing. But the truth is that the source of the waterfall had a lot of iron in it. When it comes into contact with oxygen, it changes its color to red, which stains the water. Number eight, there's diamonds in the air. There's no rainfall in Antarctica, but it does have diamond dust. 
This is caused by water droplets in the air that freeze to become ice. When they catch, it looks like a trillion diamonds are thrown up in the sky. What? <laughs> you thought it was real diamonds? Well, so did we. Yes, we were shook. But which one of these facts has been the most surprising to you? Comment below and we'll pin the best one. Hopefully, we are not alone in nearly packing our bags to go out and collect diamonds. And make sure you take part in our very awesome contest. Basically, you guys will comment about any topic that you would like to learn about, and we will make deals with several high up people to make sure you get the information within 15 days in a wacky video form. If you are the winner, we pick on Sunday. Like this video and share it with every one of your family and friends who loves the cold, and let them be insanely upset when they find out all of these facts connect Antarctica and heat. Subscribe to our channel for more videos that will give you knowledge about our beautiful universe. That's all, guys. We will see you on the next crazy episode of Explained. Make sure you tune in.